Guys, welcome back to Lab Cyber. Hope you're having an amazing week so far. So for today's video, I thought I'd do something a little bit different from the usual content around cybercrime and AI and so on. And instead, talk about something fun. Now, I'm pretty sure you may have seen on social media these toy boxes going viral where you will have a toy figure, usually on the left, and then on the right, you'll have certain kinds of accessories that are depicting who the uh, toy figure is. So just as an example, here, here is one right here. We have somebody called Raymond Rainbows wearing his glasses. And uh, you have the singer Beer, which is very, very popular in Thailand. You've got the laptop, the microphone. Why is there a lady in a bikini? Don't ask me. I'm not the one who created this particular uh, image. But then here's another one right here, kind of similar. You have somebody called Nomad Tomas. And big shout out to Tomas, a subscriber to the channel. He was the one who actually suggested I make this video. So big shout out to you, Tomas. Thank you for the suggestion. So to, no, uh, Tomas here is obviously a digital nomad. He's got his laptop, he's got the camera, the Sabadi Crab uh, message, which is Thai for hello. And of course, uh, his bottle of water, very, very important. And here's another one from Thailand as well. Uh, if you've ever been to Thailand or you live in Thailand, you may get the joke here. It's actually very, very, very funny. Not that I'm promoting getting drunk or anything like that, but uh, here's another one from Thailand as well. Don't blame me. I do live in Thailand. Do forgive me. So here is one which I thought was very, very, very cute. You do have the Thai teacher right here. And of course, you have her accessories, the Thai flag. You also have kind of like the, the chalkboard with some Thai text in there and also the uh, Thai uh, dictionary. So I'm pretty sure you've seen examples of this going viral on the internet. So today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can create these kinds of boxes either for yourself, your family, your friends, and so on. And let me show you the ones I actually created myself. Here is one depicting a black hat uh, cyber criminal. We do have him in, in, of course, the classic hoodie, dark shades, and the accessories right there. And here's another one, the good guy, the cyber professional. So let me show you exactly how I created these two boxes. So for the first one in here, all right, this was the prompt I gave it. I said, create a 3D cartoon art toy model based on the person in this image. Now, one thing you should know is that you will have to upload an actual image of the person you're trying to depict. In this case, I used my image here, me wearing a suit. So ChatGPT knows, okay, I'm going to create a toy figure from this person. And then I said the main figure should be on the left side, accessories on the right side, and they include laptop, security badge, excellent hard drive, headphones. Uh, don't worry, I will include the prompts in the comment section below, so don't worry about that. Uh, everything should be placed inside a black packaging box with the name Cyber Professional displayed at the top as the model name. So there you go right there. I like the output, but then I say, you know what? Let's make it a bit more colorful. So I said, let's go with green color. I didn't like the green, the shade of green it gave me here. You can see it's too, it's too greenish. So I specified the actual shade of green that I like, and I specified it by saying, hey, change the green color to this particular value. This is the hexadecimal value for the shade of green that I want. So if, you, if you're looking for a specific kind of shade of color, you can specify the hexadecimal value and ChatGPT uh, will do it for you. And finally, I said, can you add some stylish pattern to the box, something related to cybersecurity and there you go. This is the final output right here. And you can see the style. We have like the uh, symbols for a key, a padlock, encryption, and so on. So I thought this was actually really, really nice. But now let me show you the second one, how I created this one. All right. Over here, I uploaded this particular image, which is also the same profile picture that I have on my dating profiles. Maybe that's why I haven't gotten a date so far. But uh, anyway. Let's uh, <laughs> let's move on. So I said, create a 3D cartoon art toy model based on the person in this image. But now notice the difference in this particular prompt. I said, the main figure should be on the left side, dressed in a hoodie and wearing dark shades. So you can actually specify the kind of clothing you want the image or the person to wear. And then I said, on the right side, uh, sexes will be the laptop, VPN device, external hard drive, headphones. Everything should be placed inside the black packaging box with the name Black Hat displayed as the model name, and I said, the box should have red and black stripes and something stylish pattern related to computer hacking. So this was the initial output, which I felt, okay, I liked it, 
but I needed a l- little bit more kick. So I went back and I said, add the text, computer breached in the red color on the laptop. And this is the final product right there. So guys, you can have plenty of fun creating these kinds of boxes, either for yourself, your family, your loved ones, your friends, and so on. So what I will do, like I said, is I'm going to provide you with the prompts I use for both of these. Uh, this one right here. And then also this one, I'll provide them for you in the comment section below. So that's it for today's video, guys. Just something a little bit different, something fun. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. Share this video with anyone who may feel might benefit from it. And of course, if you're new here to the channel, welcome to Lab Cyber, where I talk about uh, cybersecurity, AI, and much more. So if you do enjoy content like this, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you're notified whenever I upload a new tutorial. Stay safe out there, and I'll see you next time. Cheers.